planning a trip to Berlin? Let's dive into the heart of Germany, where history and modernity coexist in a beautiful harmony. Berlin, a city where every brick narrates a tale, every corner is a testament to its vibrant culture, and every street is an open art gallery. From the remnants of a divided era to the bustling cosmopolitan life of today, Berlin is a city that never fails to captivate. Stay tuned as we explore the top 10 must-visit locations in Berlin. First stop, the Brandenburg Gate. A standing testament to the city's history, this neoclassical marvel located in the heart of Berlin is brimming with stories. Commissioned by Frederick William II of Prussia as a sign of peace, the gate was completed in 1791. Since then, it has played a central role in significant historical events. During the Cold War, the Brandenburg Gate was a symbol of divided Germany, as it stood right at the border of East and West Berlin. With the fall of the Berlin Wall, it transformed into an emblem of unity and peace. When you visit, try to catch the gate at sunrise or sunset. The golden light cascading on the sandstone columns makes for a breathtaking sight. And remember, the gate is pedestrian-friendly, so take your time to soak in the details. A symbol of Berlin, the Brandenburg Gate is a must-see. Next, we venture to Museum Island. Located in the heart of Berlin, this island is home to five extraordinary museums, each boasting a unique collection of artifacts and artworks. Let's start with the Altes Museum, a neoclassical gem housing a vast array of Greek and Roman antiquities. Next door, the Neues Museum showcases ancient Egyptian and prehistoric pieces, including the famed bust of Nefertiti. The Alte National Gallery is a paradise for lovers of 19th century art, while the Bode Museum houses a diverse collection of sculptures, Byzantine art, and coins. Finally, the Pergamon Museum, the most visited in Berlin, takes you on a journey through the ancient world with its monumental structures. A pro tip for visitors, consider getting a day ticket, which grants you access to all five museums. The island is open every day, so you can plan your visit at your leisure. Museum Island, a treasure trove of history and culture. Now we pay our respects at the Berlin Wall Memorial. Situated at the historic site on Bernauerstrasse, this memorial stands as a solemn testament to a divided city and a divided world. The Berlin Wall, which once stretched nearly a hundred miles, was more than just a physical barrier. It was a symbol of ideological conflict, a chilling representation of the Cold War. Today, the memorial preserves a section of the wall, complete with a border strip and watchtower, presenting a tangible piece of history. The documentation center there provides a detailed account of the wall's history and the stories of those whose lives were impacted by it. The memorial is not just a place of remembrance, but also a place of learning. It reminds us of the value of freedom and the cost of its absence. The Berlin Wall Memorial, a poignant reminder of Berlin's past. Let's marvel at the Berlin Cathedral. This colossal monument, known as the Berliner Dom in German, is an architectural marvel that commands attention. It's a historical gem in the heart of Berlin, dating back to the late 19th century, and is an embodiment of the city's rich past. With its intricate design and grand structure, the cathedral is a testament to the architectural prowess of Julius Karl Raschdorf, who designed this masterpiece. As you walk through the cathedral, you're taken on a journey through time, with each corner telling a different story. The cathedral's grand organ, with its nearly 7,000 pipes, is a sight to behold, and the panoramic view of the city from the dome is simply breathtaking. For visitors, don't miss the Hohenzollern Crypt, an eerie yet intriguing part of the cathedral housing nearly 100 sarcophagi. And remember, the cathedral is not just a place of worship, but a cultural venue hosting concerts, exhibitions, and lectures. The Berlin Cathedral, a testament to Berlin's architectural grandeur. Next, we take you to the buzzing Alexanderplatz. This large public square and transport hub in the central Mitte district of Berlin is named after the Russian Tsar Alexander I, who visited the city in 1825. Today, it's a bustling center of urban life, brimming with shops, restaurants, and a variety of attractions. One of the key landmarks here is the World Time Clock, a rotating installation displaying the time in different zones around the globe. Then there's the iconic television tower, towering above the square with its striking spherical observation deck. 
A visit to Alexander Platz isn't complete without experiencing its vibrant market, a haven for foodies and bargain hunters alike. And for history buffs, the nearby St. Mary's Church and Neptune Fountain are must-sees. As for navigating Alexander Platz, it's easily accessible by public transport and is pedestrian-friendly. Just keep in mind it can get quite busy during peak hours. Alexander Platz, where modern Berlin comes alive. Let's step back in time at Checkpoint Charlie. This site is more than just a tourist attraction. It's a symbol of Berlin's turbulent past. During the Cold War, Checkpoint Charlie served as a crossing point between East and West Berlin, named after the third letter of the NATO phonetic alphabet, Charlie. It became a symbol of division, but also of unity, as it was one of the few gateways through the Berlin Wall. Fast forward to today, Checkpoint Charlie stands as a powerful reminder of those times. It's been transformed into an open-air exhibit, complete with historical photographs and information panels that narrate its riveting history. And yes, you can even get your passport stamped with a novelty East or West Berlin stamp for a small fee, of course. Whether you're a history buff or just curious, a visit here will give you a glimpse into a pivotal time in world history. Checkpoint Charlie, a gateway to Berlin's Cold War history. Now we unwind at the verdant Tiergarten. This sprawling urban park spanning over 200 hectares sits at the heart of Berlin. The Tiergarten has a rich history dating back to the 16th century when it was a hunting ground for the Brandenburg electors. Over the centuries, it has transformed from a royal hunting park to a public city park bearing witness to the city's evolution. Today, it's a relaxing retreat for locals and tourists alike, offering attractions like the iconic Victory Column, the enchanting English Garden, and the serene Boat Lake. The park is also home to Berlin's oldest zoo, which houses a diverse array of wildlife. If you're a fan of outdoor activities, you'll find plenty of jogging, cycling, and picnic spots. Remember to check out the park's numerous statues and monuments that dot the landscape. They tell a story of Berlin's past, present, and future. Tiergarten, Berlin's green oasis in the city. Let's admire the art at the East Side Gallery. This open-air gallery is a vibrant testament to freedom and creativity, spanning over a kilometer along the Spree River. It's a unique spectacle where the remnants of the Berlin Wall have transformed into a canvas for artists around the world. The East Side Gallery came to life in the spring of 1990 after the fall of the Berlin Wall. Over a hundred artists from across the globe converged here to turn the symbol of division into a celebration of unity. Each mural has a story to tell, reflecting the political changes of the time and the hope for a brighter future. When visiting, take your time to appreciate the artistry, and remember these are not just paintings on a wall, but statements of freedom. And while photographs are a must, refrain from graffiti to preserve these historical pieces for generations to come. East Side Gallery, where the Berlin Wall turns into art. Finally, we ascend the iconic television tower. Standing high and proud in the city's skyline, it's a symbol of Berlin's innovation and resilience. Constructed in the late 1960s, this tower was a proud demonstration of East Germany's technological prowess during the Cold War. Today, it's a testament to the city's history and its journey through time. The television tower, or Fernsehturm as the locals call it, is more than just a broadcasting site. With its shiny sphere and towering antenna, it's the highest accessible building in Europe, standing at a whopping 368 meters. It offers a rotating restaurant and a panoramic observation deck, providing a breathtaking 360-degree view of the city. Visitors, take note. It's best to book your tickets online in advance to avoid long queues. Also, visit during the late afternoon to catch the city bathed in the golden hues of sunset, the television tower offering the best views of Berlin. So, are you ready for your Berlin adventure? From the iconic Brandenburg Gate to the culturally rich Museum Island, the poignant Berlin Wall Memorial to the majestic Berlin Cathedral, we've journeyed through the bustling Alexanderplatz, explored the historical Checkpoint Charlie, reveled in the verdant Tiergarten, admired the East Side Gallery's art, and marveled at the towering television tower, each location offering a unique slice of Berlin's fascinating history and vibrant culture. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Berlin. Safe travels!